here welcome to my channel for those of you who are here for the very first time welcome and for those of you who are returning welcome back today i'm doing another unboxing video of this unit that i have on here it is a long unit which i have not done in months because i don't care for long hair that much and i like light hair not dark hair however i'm doing this anyway it's a decent unit you may like it you may not a lot of people here on the yt have done this unit so you have several videos to look at i can't say that it sheds like crazy so i don't know if you know i can't say it's from cutting the lace because it sheds when i run my fingers through it in the back this unit here is the peruvian it's by altre this s430 is the color that i have on so if you have not subscribed to my channel please do so also click the notification button beside that if you don't want to miss any of my videos and like comment and share if you have any questions leave those below i'll be sure to respond as always and yeah if you like to see the unboxing stick around and stay tuned okay guys i am going to do the unboxing unboxing of this outro lace front it is in the style peruvian and it is the color s430 and i bought this from wigtypes.com back in july so hopefully they still have it i will leave all the information in the description box below let's get to this i know a lot of people have done this i ordered this wig so long ago and just forgot to even do a review on it the stock card has the usual information it has your care guide. It has your step my step instruction on how to cut the net off of it and how to brush it and care for it. And that's just about it. Let's see if you can use heat on it. It says heat resistant, safe up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. It comes in additional colors and those colors are listed across the bottom and mine again is a four third let me take it out of the net and show you guys what it looks like on the inside let's flip it inside out it has your standard cap it has the hard lace on the front very hard to me it has two combs in the front of it one on each side of the head it has an l part pretty wide i would say at least a half an inch wide it has one comb in the back and the two adjustable straps has the breathable cap and that is about it so just the standard construction so i am going to cut this lace off it's probably up just about an inch of lace on the front of it that is just about it oh my hair fell over so you can't see it and let me do that again okay see here it's only about an inch of lace and again like i said it's the hard lace so some people like that some people don't i pretty much don't care for it too much i'd rather have a softer lace but that's what we have so that's what we'll work with so stick around and stay tuned for me to cut the lace and try it on okay this is the hair straight out of the pack i guess the color the light color is just in the back it is not really in the front because i don't see it it comes down below my breast to my stomach it the parting of it is very very thin it's uh, supposed to be an invisible inner part so and the part is on the right side i guess you can wear it in the middle if you want to but you see the little swoop that goes around i don't know if you want that or you can move it around and wear it on the left this hair to me feels like a barber doll hair it does not feel anything like real hair at all to me it's very very soft though it's very full has a lot of density to it most of all this hair in the front this is everything that is on the wig pulled to the front so it's very thick it doesn't appear to have well it has some layers in it small layers long layers rather so yeah if you like this type of hair and you want something soft it probably sheds like the dickens yep getting a lot of shit and i don't know if you can see that I'm just running my hands through it lots of shit mm -hmm. so yeah i think it sheds like crazy let me let you see what it looks like in the back how far it comes down it comes down just about to, to my waist i would recommend that you put something if you want a part to show if you don't want it to be an invisible part i would recommend that you put some concealer or eyeshadow in the part colors all right i don't see any any 30 not much of that at all i see a little bit in the back and you can see it there but i don't see much of it at all in the front so pretty much this thing looks more like a four and i don't really care for it but i don't like long hair so i'm kind of biased i don't sound like long hair i don't like it this long 
too much for me. That is it. I'm not gonna do anything to it. If you like the video, please thumbs up. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please make sure you do that so you don't miss any of my videos. I usually load videos every single Monday. If you like it, again, thumbs up, like, comment, and share. If you have any comments, please leave those in the description box below. I will list all the information about this unit in the description box as well as where I link to where I got it from and a couple of other links to other websites that you may want to purchase it from if they don't have it at wigtypes.com. So once again, thank you guys for stopping by my channel and I look forward to seeing you all in my next video. Bye-bye. Today I am 